Uh, in this video today, we will tour Sezibwa Falls, one of the most significant cultural sites of Uganda Kingdom. Welcome to Joyma Tourism, a one-stop center for all the information that you need for your fun pack tour destination. My name is Becky and, and I'm Jay. We have been to several destinations, but Seziwa has been a very unique one. Yeah. Uh, Jeff, if I may ask, what did you find so unique at this site? Definitely everything was unique. Oh. From the point you approach mm. the falls, mm -hmm. everything is unique. Wow. The canopy of trees mm -hmm. will give you a great breeze, mm. especially on a hot day i know you will definitely have the best experience right from the start before mm. you even get to the falls itself wow 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 the gate is made up of papyrus reeds mm. yeah and when you get in you'll actually cross a bridge mm. <laughs> this bridge is also having its own uniqueness and as you cross the bridge immediately you start the climb oh you'll cr climb the rock wow that will give you a great experience <laughs> <laughs> you will burn enough calories I by the know. time you get to the top <laughs> i know one of, a, one of my friends that i should take there he's getting so far <laughs> <laughs> so you'll have to burn enough calories Mm. Get to the top. Wow. And as you cross through those trees, mm. you'll get people who are silently talking to their gods. <laughs> gods. <laughs> <laughs> their gods. Don't ask me a particular one. Mm. I said gods. Mm. So you'll find these people who will be doing performing their uh, rituals. Mm. Uh, they are the religious and the traditionalists, of course. Mm. Uh, they do retreats there, mm -hmm. and if you're also a religious, <laughs> yeah. uh -huh. you can go retreat there, it is a quiet place, mm. and uh, as you get to the top, mm -hmm. wow. you'll hear that roaring fall of the water, no. as it drops down mm. the seven meter high rock. Wow. 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 It is just a wonderful experience. There. Wow, that, yeah. that is so interesting. Yeah. Uh, aren't there any more activities uh, that one can get interested in? There are fascinating activities. Can we finish them anyway? I know. The but I can't, I can't live without talking about this particular one. Mm -hmm. Talk about it. If you are really a lover of bird watching, uh -huh. there are Hundreds. Sure. Yes. Mm -hmm. Hundreds of bird species that you'll find at Sezwa. Mm. Because of the canopy of trees, mm. these birds find home wow. Wow. at Sezwa. Yes. So you have to go to Sezwa to reach Sezwa by 6 a.m. Mm. for you to find all these birds before they go hunting for their day's oh. food. So you yeah. have to go early you in the morning. Go early before six oh. a.m. Mm. You will get there, and you will see this variety of birds you have not seen wow. anywhere else. Wow! Wow! Yeah. Wow! That's so nice. Yeah, I I personally had a great experience at Caesar, mm. especially when it comes to the birds. Mm. Oh, the rock climbing that band. Ah, I was. I was a huge bio. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So you cut your colors. I cut the weight in just one day. <laughs> of climbing there. I see. <laughs> yes. So come to Sezwa mm. and uh, do the rock climbing. Mm. You'll have fun. Wow. Comment mm. just down yes. in the comment section. Mm. Uh, any other destinations where you have got a great experience like this one. Mm. 
mm. of Sezuwa. I'm sure you may not have any. <laughs> but make sure you comment mm. about that tour destination that gave you such a wonderful experience mm. with a pack of activities that yes, you would do. Yes, we shall be waiting.